Lanaga grade 12 sifunda about the fundamental principles of counting. Yes? As well as the probabilities involved in counting. Now, ka grade 12, grade 10, just a quick recap. Grade 10, nifunde ngabu Venn diagram. Laws of probability. Na funda nangama intersection intersection na funda ngabu union o na buye na funda ngabu complement of the complement of grade 11 na buye again ati dependent events dependent events Nangama independent events. Nabuya nanga na funda nangama contingency tables. Nabuya na funda nangama Venn diagrams. Yet again. Yet again. Yes. So you will have concepts in funding auga kuluga grade 10 and 11. Grade 12 examination. Lama topics asa pumala. From grade 10 to grade 11. In the description box, Nishiyama links for these lessons, grade 11 and grade 12. Please watch it now. Lanaga grade 12, into Zoe Funda, it's this one. Ama fundamental counting principles as well as the probability formula involved in counting when applied to e, e counting. Sinama counting rules, I4. In this video, Sizo count, Sizo, Sizo, best discuss the first one. Right, the fundamental one, counting principle. Ogbala, of course, you was. You know how to count. You know how to count. You was Ogbala. I'm sure of that. I ma circles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I seven. Of course, you know how to count. Of course, you know how to count. Right, but. The fundamental counting principle, or rule number one, Uti, Uti Geti, rule number one, if one operation can be done in M ways and a second operation can be done in N ways, then the total possible number of different ways in which both operations can be done is M times N. This is rule number one. We have a second rule, of course. We have a third rule. We have a fourth rule as well. In this video, we will cover only the first rule. The remaining three rules, so I, please we'll check in the description box of this video. We will tell my links to those lessons as well. So, Lana, we are covering only the first rule. Okay, rule number one, we'll stay talo, right? Let's say, for example, I have two yama operations. You know, option one, let's say I'm trying to no create a, maybe a painting, right? A beautiful painting, Ganj. So, unama options I two, ne? Unama options I two. Go option one, you need to take only one color. We pair no bani, no, ne new color in option number two. The question is, in how many different ways in how many different ways can we combine combine let's say combine one color in option a and another color in option two combine one color in option one and one color footy in option two in option number two this is one all right that's the question so for example in a tata wu are him sang and he said no oh we have one him sang and he no oh or in tattoo are him sang and he no why in tattoo are him sang and he no g Green, right? Mwen it ng sang and tatu P, the purple ni sang and iseno orange, ng tatu purple ng sang and iseno y, ng tatu purple ng sang and iseno green food. 
ublu nge mslangani seno orange ublu nge mslangani seno y ublu nge mslangani seno bani no green so these are the different ways we can take one color in first option and take another color in option number two you can only pick one lana you can only pick one na lana ku option number two so as wabale lama combinations i one two three four five six seven eight nine right i nine in total so this was a question the answer it is going to be nine la nine but because of a rule number one i have two operation operation number one can be done in three ways option number two can also be done in what in three ways so no operation one operation two so it's m times n therefore it means that we can just say learning number operation one in three ways three times go option, go option number two now how many ways three ways na quarter so three times three it's nine so the first principle or rule number one or ca the counting principle rule number one was fundisa ukuthi if you have two operations done in x ways and operation number two done in y ways you just say t x times y so this is the counting as kulumangayula na ku probability to lag grade 12 yes now i started an example so that ni kombis with the kombis other ways abanga buza ngayo u rule number one so example number one so si se mtimbi ni se party ni msambe si prepare for a party nyana so yabon we need to prepare ama party packs for abantuan yabon but a party pack of three items can be made up by selecting one item of the following choices. So it's not choices. It's not one choice number one. Smarties, Astros, Jelly Tots, Wine Gum. Some are sweets. Good choice, good choice number one. A party pack should be over nani. Some are sweets. A wave nani. Ne beverage. Coke, Fanta, Sprite, Ginger Beer, Cream Soda. Option number three. Donut, Chelsea bun, Chelsea bun, and a cheese roll. So, go buy my sweet iso isoda beverage. Then you buy a good banana, ne pan or ma yeah ma pan ma pan ma pan. Right. So, lana we have three operations: choice one, choice two, choice number three. So, rule number one states that if one operation can be done in m ways. Operation number one is done in how many ways? One. It's done in how many ways? Let us count. One, two, three, four. Four ways. Aha. Uh -huh. And a second operation can be done in n ways. One, two, three, four, five. Five ways. Okay. The the rule doesn't state for a third operation, but now I be work negatively. Or third operation, you still count to foot. One, two, three. So it's three, la right. So the question is, get man. By selecting one item from each of the following choices, in how many ways can or in how many? Or how many different party packs can be made from lama choices la it means that so t four times five times three is equal to four uh, four times five that's 20 times three that's 60. so 60 different party packs can be made from lama choices i3 la yes so this is how you apply a rule number one or rule number one so yep our lesson is opelelalana guys this is the fundamental counting principle or rule number one so in the description box is otola are my links for rule number two rule number three rule number four as well as the lessons from the previous grades i hope we enjoy it i hope we totally some value out of this lesson 
okay there's nothing much to say in other rule except for doing my examples of fun and allow so for now i spawn on the next lesson bye bye